So we're on question five now. So it's giving us a scatter plot with a line of best fit shown below. So they actually give you the graph and you can open up a graph and we'll open up the chart in the new graph in the new tab to kind of see the graph. And it's asking us, what is the equation of the line of best fit? So it's asking us, what is this equation of a line? So knowing our linear relationships, what we actually have here is a, I'm not gonna draw out the line because it's gonna be too messy, but I'm gonna give you a couple of pointers about this linear, we, about this linear relationship. We know that this line here has a negative slope. And how do we know that? We know that it has a negative slope because it's actually going downwards. It's facing downwards, right? It has a downward relationship. So we know it has a negative slope, which is good. And we also know that it has a t-intercept. So it crosses uh, the t-intercept at the point. Uh, this would be at the point 10 and zero. So we know that it has a t-intercept of 10 and zero. Now it's asking us what is the equation of the best fit. So it's giving us four options here and we can immediately uh, eliminate C and D as our options because there's no way that our uh, equation is gonna have a positive slope. C and D gives us this option of A equals 10 plus three T. This is C and this here is D equals 10, sorry, this is no 30 plus 3t, which means these two relation, these two don't work out because they have, these two have a positive slope. So our answer can be either be A or B. So how do we know that? So how can we tell? So A has 10 minus 3t and B has 30 minus 3t. So how do we figure out the answer between these two? So what we can do is we can take a point from the graph, uh, actually on the line. Uh, we can take a point on the line and um, solve for the equation of the line. So what we know about the graph so far is we know that A equals, we don't know, we actually don't know the intercept. We don't know what when it hits A. So we're gonna leave this as B, right? Remember our general equation for line is Y equals MX plus B. We know for a fact that our slope here is negative 3T but we don't know our we don't know our y intercept right so i'm just going to this as b but what we can do is actually we can we can plug in two points and we can figure out what the graph is here and we can solve for a variable so i'm going to take the point i'll take the point 10 and 0 actually because that's what we were given in the first place so in this case here we have 0 as our a it's equal it's going to equal sorry it's going to equal negative three times 10 plus B. And we're gonna isolate for B, right? So we have zero equals negative three times 10 here in negative 30 plus B. We're gonna move negative 30 to the right side, or sorry, to the left side. So we're gonna add 30 to both sides, which means this is positive 30 equals B, right? So now we can actually redefine our equation in line because we know that B is 30. So we can say that Y equals negative, sorry, negative three T plus 30, which is exactly the same here equation as we have for B, except it's flipped, right? We have 30 on this side, minus three T, they both mean the same thing, which means our answer here is B.